Welcome back, guys, to Final Fantasy VII Rebirth. We're having a ride at the Costa del Sol and taking a leisurely stroll around it to uh, finish off our last session, our last episode, because let's face it, we did just face Genova Emergent, a big boss fight. Chapter 6, Fool's Paradise, has now gone underway where we've been scouting things out but realizing that everything's kind of locked until we get ourselves a room, probably just the same as this is. Sorry, but we're still setting things up. Come back later. Couldn't have guessed. So with that said and with that done, I need to get myself a wheelie again. We've checked out the shops a little bit. But if I get on the wheelie, I can keep racking up my times. Let me on. Got to build up our timer, right? I could totally drive this thing. Duh. Yeah. <laughs> so we're going to not over here, which is Pirate's Rampage. We can check that out before we go to the thing. That guy got special wheelie. I want that one. I'm very sorry, but we're still getting set up. Please come back later. So I feel like there's going to be lots of mini games in our future. Is this a shooting game? I'm guessing that ship's supposed to represent something incredibly special. Yeah, I've got a stolen this one now. All right, let me in. We hope you enjoy your time. Hello, <laughs> I'm here. I'm parking up. We're only accepting customers with prior reservations today. We hope to see you again soon. Okay, we gotta look for another hotel. Or I could just dark. Knock it over. Oh, what? I was going to, like, rage out, but everything is fixed to the floor in this hotel. We sincerely look forward to seeing you again soon. Tifa! Cloud, my bro! Hmm? Tifa! No way. Johnny? <sighs> Whew. Hey, guys. Looking good. <laughs> Same to you. So, what are you doing here? Living the dream. Building my legend. Being the owner of a bona fide hotel. Though not exactly a luxury one. What a coincidence. We were just looking for a place to stay. Do you have any rooms? Do I have rooms? I got rooms for days. Enough rooms to make your head spin. <laughs> That's what happens when you have no guests. <laughs> I don't know about this. Don't need to be shy. We go way back, right? <laughs> it's the least I can do. All right, let's get you settled in. Now? Of course, come on. <laughs> Make sure you stick close. Can't have my guests getting lost. Just bought the place, so I'm still doing repairs here and there. But all things considered, it's looking pretty sweet. How I got my hands on it, though, now that's a story. I was cursed with the unholy trinity. No job, no money, and worst of all, no girl. I was a nobody with nothing, walking garbage. But Mayor Capono believed in me said I was destined to make something of myself, so he sold me a hotel for cheap. How cheap, you ask? Half market price cheap. The dude even loaned me the money for it. There's no kinder man in all the world. Could you remove the boxes? You might get more customers. What? Like, just, just a business suggestion. Like... You might actually get some customers. Yeah, what the hell? It's not like a terrible place. It does seem to have some gaps in the woodwork up top, mind you, but just move the boxes, man. Hey, guys. <laughs> Behold my pride and joy. Johnny's Seaside Inn. <sighs> wow. It's, uh... I don't know. Great. I know, right? Maybe my eyes are failing me, but I don't see no seaside. It's not about the sights, but the smells. 
Ah, how that fresh salt air tickles the nose. Well, come on in. I want to do some thatching work or something. I do worry about how cold this place might be at night. Okay, let's get everyone checked in. Tifa, you'll be staying in room 101. Aerith, you're in 102. As for the dudes, you can all bunk together in 103. The price? I'd never even think of charging you. Besides, uh, I gotta run. The mayor requires my assistance at this time. Make yourselves at home. Not like there's anyone else here anyway. Oh, you guys better not head to the beach looking like that. And don't even think of bringing those weapons with you. Oh, fate is so cruel, depriving me of Tifa and beachwear. Time for that shower? Yeah, I'd say so. See you guys soon. How soon is soon? Soon enough. No need to stick to a schedule here. Right? Right. You win. Think I'll go take a walk. So, no, I should maybe get changed first. <laughs> Still looking good. Well, back in a bit. Is that shading underneath his hump? Is <laughs> Oh, my party selection is locked. To just me? Come in, Red. Well ventilated, plenty of shade, a lovely hotel. Oh yeah, you put the right spin on it. I agree, you probably would like it. I don't want to talk again about things though. Uh, I'm assuming I just got to get changed first then? What the hell would I get changed into? Yeah, I was not expecting the door to not be locked. I was going to say, I was expecting like a dialogue. Hi, right, guys. Uh... Oh, they're probably in the shower. Very well ventilated. Well, I'm guessing it's mild nights. <laughs> Hold down the fort till I get back. Oh, yeah, it's a handy one of those holders. <laughs> Every house needs one. All right, Beach Boys has begun. <laughs> Don't have any whacking stick anymore. Sad times. I'm still not really hey, dressed for the beach. Why you gotta do me like that, shower? I'm guessing it came out cold first. if I try to sit on it. Much less sleep. Do you need me to test that? No, okay. Again, a reminder, I'm only ever doing that to see if there's dialogue. I know how it may come off to some that someone's trying to be a rampant perv, but that's not what's going on. What's a stand-up guy like you staying at a dump like this for? I can show you somewhere way better. Place is a sty, right? Whole building's barely worth a hundred gil, and yet the owner's drowning in debt to keep it open. Takes a special kind of sucker to wind up in a mess like that, you know. Dang, for, for free? <laughs> Place is a sty, right? Whole building's barely worth a hundred gil, and yet the owner's drowning in debt to keep it open. Takes a special kind of sucker to wind up in a mess like that, you know. Thanks for telling me twice. I couldn't even skip until he'd finished with the audible dialogue. <laughs> Can we move these boxes ourselves, please? Hey, how about an orb or two? All right. Hey, Liz! Don't tell me you're alone. The beach is for partying. And one's not a party. It's 
That's a pity. But you don't have to be lonely any longer. We're bringing people together, solo sun tanners like you, for the special event. One we guarantee will spice up your social life. Find love at Costa Del Amor. So, will you be joining us or what? I'll pass. Aww. Got plans with those guys. Later. Uh, uh, so, they're friends of yours? Then, can you do us a solid? Those roped people are a little different, right? And they've kind of been creeping the other guests out. I mean, look at their clothes. They kill the vibe. So, if you could get them out of here, we'd be so grateful. Speaking of clothes, they'll never let you on the beach looking like that. This is Costa del Sol. You gotta loosen up. Let it all out. And to help you with that, here's lucky ticket number seven. Take it. With that, you can play Pirate's Rampage and Card Carnival. But not all by your lonesome. Your number's the same as someone else's. Mm -hmm. Find them, and you've got yourself a team. Work together, master the games, and you'll earn companion cards. <laughs> you can turn those in for beachwear. And once you're dressed to impress, you'll finally be ready to hit the beach. Right? right? So start searching and let the fun begin. Best of luck finding that special someone. <laughs> Hang <Hello>. loose! <laughs> <laughs> I'd place for it being, in a bet, being Yuffie, but we'll see who's got the other card. Despite what the robed individual's presence suggests, beachwear is required to access the waterfront. Participate in Costa del Amor events to earn companion cards and exchange them for more beach-appropriate ensembles and hit the sand. Mini-games? Did anyone want some mini-games? Oh, I guess you're the trade. Want to exchange companion cards for beachwear? You'll need to participate in Costa del Amor. You just gotta beat the event's games with a partner. Go see who's gonna trade clouds cards. Seven, wild surf, and ocean chocobo. <laughs> Come again. Horse with the shorts. I guess he looks more like Sora in the silhouette. Okay, so we have the options of. We got Beach Boys down there. That must be the car place. Pirates Rampage. Those are the only two things we could take part in at the moment. Got my distance traveled on this though. <laughs> Just run these people there. It's fine. <laughs> Worry, I'm dodging you. I meant to go that way so I could see about the test drive event. How much have we reached already at this point? And what was the top reward again? From, from out of the way, people. I'm a slightly better driver than you. Is that way I'd look at it? Do you reckon I'm a slightly better driver than All you need to do is pick a wheelie to rent, ride it to your heart's content, then claim your prize when you're done. Okay, so 4,000 is the top one. So we've got to 1,000. So seven high Let's potions. Let's see what the odometer says, shall we? Congratulations! You've earned yourself a veteran license! How have you been enjoying your time on that wheelie? Mm -hmm. That's the look of one satisfied customer. And this prize is sure to lift your spirits even more. I'm a veteran now. A veteran of the wheelies. Excuse me then, people. Uh, kind of getting in the way. Oh, I've overshot one place. Oh, that's another place for swimsuits? I'm very sorry, but we only accept companion cards. You can get them from Costa del Amor events, so find a partner and play. So still just clown cards. So I feel you. All the one location. Tough decision to make. Not right. a tough decision. I just don't have anything. Who wants to go on a pirate's rampage? Shoot down enemies it's like going with you, buddy. And capture the heart of your special someone. You know, my special someone. Hey, got a ticket for this thing called Costa del Amor. Don't know what it is, but it's happening here, so. It's a special event for uh, meeting new people. But 
Looks like you and me got paired up. Wait, what? Why do you care about meeting new people? For the companion cards. What do we have here? Looks like it's right up my alley. Whoa, hold on there. You use firearms for a living, don't you? Sorry, but I can't allow you to play this game. Amateurs only. That's our policy. Oh, it is, is it? Why didn't you speak up sooner? I don't see any signs either. This is false advertising. You know that? I'll do it. <sighs> Just don't embarrass us. Right. <laughs> Forego swashbuckling in favor of sharpshooting as you aim to hit the fiendish targets and earn a high score. We have fire, aim, switch aim and fire controls, toggle aim speed, and adaptive triggers. <laughs> what? I don't know what that means. Fire, aim. Surely that's all I need. <laughs> Probably isn't. 15k for a time material. Ooh. Companion car for cloud, 10k. Of course, we're going for the high score. All right, man. Blast them in the next week. No reload needed. What does that mean if you go purple? Oh, Ooh. hey, what are you doing? What's the difference between the purple ones? I don't even know. Hell yeah! Now that's what I like to see. Ah! Nice. Beautiful shot. Ever so slightly missing. What the hell was that guy? Oh, there was a guy there? I didn't know. It's always shot. Ah, yeah. Ooh, bullseye, <laughs> baby. Hell yeah. And that's what I like to see. Very nice. Beautiful shot. Fair an accuracy bonus. Ooh. What did I just kill? <laughs> this is it. Your moment. Show us what you made of. I see you, Cactus. Very nice. Beautiful shot. Very nice. Beautiful shot. Shoot them all! <laughs> Give me more! I think I won. <laughs> Did I go too hard? I don't know. <laughs> I realized that. No, let's not do this! Because, of course, it's got like the, the pullback. So I stopped going like this and I started going like that instead. <laughs> Tapping like that. I don't know, maybe, maybe, maybe speed up quite a bit. Just hitting the controller against my hand versus bringing the pad to the controller. <laughs> Uh, damn, give it up for us. We make a great team. Well done, gentlemen. With play like that, you must have known each other for years. The shooting and the shouting was a sight to behold. <laughs> you hear that? A sight to behold. It's his job to butter us up. Oh, come on, man. Just drop the jaded act for a minute and take the compliment. I promise I won't tell. <laughs> Anyhow, I'm off to enjoy the beach. Don't leave me hanging too long here. Trying to build a swimsuit, but it looks like I have to play cards now? Oh no. Yeah. If you're still there, then. 
What else is going on? Okay, we've got this over here, the Beach Boys. I'm just wondering, is this open now? Can I come in? Rub. Welcome to the Royal Coast. I guess not. I want to see the piano concert. Wow, I just got it backwards. That's amazing. I have skills. Alright, so we got over here, we got Card Carnival. Over here, we've got just the main scenario bit. So I'm assuming I need to go to that instead of to the beach, check Because I'm not allowed on the beach. Save your aching feet and ride a wheelie instead. Register here for the great... Beat the heat with this magical treat. So for the great cactal caper? Wanna play card carnival? It's Queen's hey. with a twist. Regina, so, you're you my partner? Some blood? Hey there. What's up? Oh, let me guess. Searching for a more partner? I am. <laughs> and now you found her. Just so you know, the rules are different for this event. Instead of the usual one-on-one -on -one format, we have to play in teams, which is why I'm glad you're here. I'm sure this won't come as a shock, but I didn't sign up to lose. With you on my team, though, I doubt I'll have anything to worry about. Between the two of us, there's no one better at the game. Want to try your luck? Then step right on up! I don't know, I think Michaela's pretty good. I like the one-on-one -on -one format of most Queen's Blood matches. Costa de la Moore allows players to compete in pairs. The house provides the cards while you provide the cunning in these puzzles designed to test your QB acumen. Complete free challenges to win. This game loves Queen's Blood, doesn't it? <laughs> so you've just done a Queen's Blood tournament. How about having to play more Queen's Blood? <laughs> so that you can get this, your main story continued again. What's a more fun than a game of Queen's Blood? A puzzle. Your opponents laid their cards on the table. Place yours in the right spot at the right time to emerge victorious. Your partner, Regina, has already completed this challenge. If you complete it as well, the two of you will proceed. So I'm the one who has to do it. So, what's your next move? So I have three cards. I'm... I was assuming there'd be a buffing card. So, what's the goal here? Do I need to get a space that has five? Yeah, I do. As long as I've got one with six on it, I win, right? If I, like, have six on the top one... Ah, but there's a uh, there's two tours. Okay. So I see what might be the issue here. Aha! Uh -huh. <laughs> so like, if I were to place this here, I could get some ones, but I the others all plant on twos. And I have to get it on the top one. Obviously, this is the first card to be played. That gets a two, but that doesn't get a two. Surely the only one, only place this one can be done is here then. I'm just wondering how like the next one goes in. So it's, it's not Quetz next. It's not the zoo next either. Or is it the zoo so you win five to four? I think you just win five huh. to four then. Interesting. You know, that's not bad. Yeah, okay. I was thinking honest. of having two on the same alleyway, but... I was thinking of just straight up winning on the four lane by with six, but that obviously that was not where I could place it. Oh, we actually get cards from this. The Fleetwing card has got. All right, Posh Chocobo as a reward. I would like to ride the Posh Chocobo. Oh, Posh Chocobo on the Chocobo. Don't lose focus. You hear me? 
Rodeo? Oh, look, it's Oh, it's cute posh. 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 When you win the lane, receive a score bonus of three. Okay. So you've got to very specifically win the lane. All of these are buffed. I mean, it looks like we're aiming for there, but... Put that to a two. Check about Moogle, raise power by one for each other enhanced ally card. So it will be raised up a bit. I've got to specifically win the lane. Oh, Chocobo will win that lane with Fat Chocobo. The question is just... <sighs> I think that's what it will be, is because it's the only one that can go there. So it's like definitely leading this yeah. as we'll the main lead out. point, isn't it? And to be honest, there's not much else you can do than that. You played that on purpose? No, I didn't. I just... Do you even know the rules? Yeah, I obviously don't know the rules because I only win by two, which means I lose. So where the hell do I get this? Oh, no, it goes down there after you put the post chocobo there. <laughs> That's what I wasn't looking at. The po I wasn't looking Finish at Posh Chocobo's stupid way of putting down. Still too early to tell. Huh. Didn't know you had it in you. So now it's 14. Which still loses, doesn't it? Could have done worse, that's for sure. Still loses, though. It's because you need to be put down first? No. Oh, no, wait a second. The plus three isn't there yet, so it's 17. But the plus three isn't calculated yet. Doesn't show up as the 14. Okay, Andrew. I'm like, I am correct, but I'm also... Oh, you got me. All right, then. Have the Moogle Trio summon the Mage and Bartio Hand and use their unique abilities to come out on top. The Moogle Trio card. Come on, hit him where it hurts. Okay, we've got two doublers and a singular. Nine, four, seven. The Moogle Trio summons two guys to my hand, but I don't know in what way they do. Uh, well, I have no clue how this is going to turn out. So that. what I'm going to do is I'm going to summon these guys. No, not that one. Not that one. Playing it pretty safe, I see. Because I need to find out what these guys even do. Raise the power of allied cards on affected tiles by two while this is in play. And also a... Is this an attack? Kills one. Okay, if I knew that could have maybe used that. So that's going to buff to in front. So that should once you go here then. To buff more cards. We lower by three. So it's six, seven, 13 versus eight. It's not going to win me anything. So this is probably obviously a failure. I need to be... Either there or... To buff up two cards versus one. No, that's not bad. Seems to be it. Okay. Finish him off. So that one maybe needs to be specifically here. Didn't know you had it in you. <laughs> well, I guess these blooming dialogue points are the things that's mainly there to get me to know what's going on. Well, we'll see how that plays out. It's 
Can I still kill that or I can kill that one? That one's the highest point total one. I'm only drawing that top row though, so this is actually going well at all. <laughs> oh no, I take the middle row. Keep that up and you'll be fine. I f then I buff these two. No, that's not bad. And then I can win the bottom row. Could have done worse, that's for sure. Okay. I mean, you gotta understand, the first time round is me just figuring out what this card does. <laughs> like when we did the Shiva card stuff and went, oh, that sucks. Congratulations! You two sure know how to win in style. Come back whenever you like. Thanks for being my partner. Haven't had that much fun in a while. I could be persuaded to go again. That's a funny way of asking for a favor. <laughs> I appreciate the sentiment, but I don't play matches I already know I'm gonna win. Would much rather spend that time upping my game. But I won. Sadly, I don't meet many people who can teach me much. Though I did run into you. Anyway, I'm sure we'll see each other around sometime. Good luck! Oh my, shot you down. We also offer one-on-one -on -one matches though, so don't worry about it. Do you? You complete every easy rank card puzzle. There's more. Welcome to Card Carnival. Oh shoot, there's more. Okay. Come again. So apart from that, we can obviously get our gear now. Let's get that before it's puzzling even further. I've just overshot it. Completely unintentionally. So I don't rack up more on the Odomia anyway. Hang loose. Hang loose. <laughs> Got any companion cards? I do. You can exchange them for outfits here. Alright then, let's get Wild Surf and Ocean Chocobo. Live into your beachwear at one of the chain new booths set up at convenient locations around town, such as the entrance to the beach or near Johnny's Seaside Inn. Have a wonderful day. I mean, right here. Oh, I have to get off. Ex soldier first class. We're changing it up. So we could go with the topped variety or the topless variety. Oh, we actually get two different choices. This is the variety for those who don't like to have skin issues. So people are like, you have no sense of fun. And this is for those that do. <laughs> right, I didn't see any lotion. Where's the suntan lotion? Right, well.